there guys what is going on Sloppy here playing some more of this game uh creativeverse is what it's called and uh i was uh I, I logged off in here and i thought i'd start recording in here because these new blocks are so cool i love the interior of this spaceship it's just awesome and this door effect i mean seriously just so cool i'm not actually working over here today i'm not doing anything to do with these blocks even i don't think I just thought it'd be a nice place to start, because why not start on the uh, Millennium Penguin? Yeah, that works. The Millennium Penguin. Our canyon mining spaceship. Awesome. Either way, um, I do have something I want to mention to you guys, which we're going to go to a new area to talk about real quick. I'll meet you guys over there. I think it was last Tuesday I mentioned starting my own... Um, other world to do a new museum on and um, this is said world I did a live stream where we uh, I guess got the basics going I have a diamond mining cell and uh, an industrial crowbar and uh, just sort of got some of the basics start when did I make a plow I don't remember that oh I needed seashells to make the diamond mining cell right I've got teleporters to some of the different biomes more or less just getting some of the basics started I just wanted to show you guys I'll probably be working on the start of this on live streams just because a lot of the initial part of creativeverse isn't all that exciting you know i'm getting mining cells i'm doing a lot of mining so this project will probably take a few streams to get up and running uh if you were curious about it i thought i'd just give a little bit of an update if you're interested in the live streams there's a bell next to the subscribe icon that'll give you notifications when i go live um, i stream on here and twitch simultaneously because i'm crazy like that and, uh, yeah, I just thought I'd give you an update, because last Tuesday, I think I waffled on about it for a while. But, yeah, it's going to be a bit before I can actually start building in this world, because I want to have, you know, a relatively solid base before I go um, too crazy with it. So, that's the story with this um, project, this world. So, I just thought I'd share that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I always forget beds have uh, fun jumping mechanics. All right, now back to the Creatinators. The first thing I want to do today uh, is over here. So this is sort of our um, base of operations, I guess you could say. When I'm not off doing other projects, this is where I have, you know, my storage and my stuff. And uh, this is a pretty cool area, but obviously there's something missing, right? We've got all this nice landscape. We've got this beautiful lake, but there's nothing in the lake. And I want to fix that today. I've been thinking about it, and I want something right in the middle of this lake. What was this area built for? You know, it's all forgotten and whatever now, but... Oh, it's a placemat. I was like, what is this log? It's just mud with a placemat. I don't know why. I, I think I was playing with placemats, maybe? Eh, doesn't matter. Anyway, I want to build something in the middle of this lake. And I'm a little stuck on what it's going to be, because I'm not, I'm not a builder of things that look like things. So I'm going to give it my best effort. I might have to ask you guys for help in a live stream or something. I'm going to give it my best effort. We're going to make a little platform. It's not going to be too big. And then we're going to try and build something on top of it. Um, I, th I think first things first, though, I kind of want to clean up these blocks. They were over here when I was showcasing this. My beautiful, beautiful Rainbow Nader sword. Um, yeah, these new galactic blocks, though, I mean, they are gorgeous. And, uh, yeah, just, just top-notch blocks. Really, just top-notch blocks. A plus. Well, A. I'll give it, well, you know what, I'll give it an A minus, just because I like to think we have only up to go. Does that make sense? I don't know. I'm really sleep deprived. So, I'm going to keep, uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to build now. I'm going to build now. Yeah. So, the first thing I've been working on is um, the platform it's actually going to stand on. You know what we need right now? I'm thinking maybe we should just put one of these, maybe right here just so we can quickly sleep i feel like i'm always running to my bedroom what if we just put one of these just right there just to quickly sleep occasionally um but yeah i decided to do the platform first because that seems obvious um so that's sort of where i want it sort of central ish and i want it to be raised one above the water but i kind of just wanted to get it in first and then i kind of want a trim with stone stairs, I think. I think I want to do like a nice trim. How do these place like that? How do these place not like that? 
Uh, okay, that's kind of bizarre, but I'll leave it. So I kind of wanted a stone stair trim. Uh, okay, I think I get how these place, these corner ones. I don't build with stairs a ton, but I think I get how they place. Uh, I kind of want, uh, no, so we'd want it to go like that, yeah. So I think I want stone stairs as a trim. So I think they're a nice block. Um, and then we'll build it sort of out of the middle. I also think the stone stairs, they're like a nice blend. Uh, yeah, you know, they look very nice. And then we're going to fill the rest in with the limestone and then build it on top. I think I might want to bring it out one more though, make it just slightly bigger. Yeah, I'm going to bring that because right now that's 9 by 9. Um, I think I'm going to make it 11 by 11. So give me just one second to finish up that and then we'll, uh, we'll try and build a statue. Well, I uh, came over here to check the recipe section of the book, and I forgot I started to build uh, this blueprint of the chizzard coop back here, which you can get for free, by the way, which is kind of cool if you uh, just want some of the galactic blocks, or, um, you know, it's worth it just to get the galactic blocks, but you can also build the chizzard coop, which I'm going to somewhere, just not here, I guess. I also want to build a statue of a penguin. There's one up there, which uh, Sided made, which is just a lovely penguin. You know, really a top-notch penguin. But uh, I think I'm going to try doing my own thing. I actually came over here to go see if there was any recipes for yellow adobe wall. Because I don't have uh, that recipe on this server. Which sucks, because that's what I want to use. He used uh, the red. Okay, I was going to go for more of a yellow foot. But I don't have that recipe, so I guess I have to rethink it. I could use... Mm, I kind of want yellow feet. You know, a little bit more duckish. And uh, so, I guess I have to find a different yellow block. What a majestic penguin. We also have to find somewhere to put this galactic coop. Oh, there's our train station. Looking lovely. This place looks good at night. Sidon's on, um, doing something mysterious. He has a cool build for back here someday. Uh, okay, yeah, I'm going to, I guess, pick a yellow block. We don't have that many options. Um, do we? Not really. I kind of like the yellow adobe because I could make the stair, which, you know, kind of looks like a foot. We've also got concrete. Uh, maybe? I don't know. I'll have to sort it out. Either way, we're going to try and build a penguin. I think I might try building this galactic coop somewhere, though. Could be kind of neat. Hmm. Actually, I think I might know a place. All right. Time to pick up everyone's favorite block. Blobs of goo, or maybe that's just some people's favorite blocks. Uh, I'm going to try and do a little bit of schnazzy-dazzy here. So this is our platform. It actually looks pretty good. This is sort of our center point. Uh, okay. Let's do... I think maybe we're going to go for a white belly around here. Right, and then we tuck his feet sort of in here. Uh, yeah, okay. I'm starting to see where this is going. Uh, no, we want more asphalt, please. More asphalt, please. It's a nice, it's a nice black block. Um, right. How tall do I want this guy to be? Uh, maybe this is good for like the body. Maybe. Uh, yeah, let's see. If I cap this off here and then put the head on top of that, let's see how this works. Yeah! Uh, okay, we're going to not round it off quite like that, but that looks pretty good. Needs a touch of work. I'm going to do a little bit more with it and then come back, but it's not terrible. I think I need to get a few more materials. I don't know what I want to use for the eyes and stuff. We get a few more materials though, and we will hmm, check it out. I need to practice my elusiveness skills. I figure if anyone ever comes in here, I can hide up in the ceiling and then drop down on them and, um, <clears throat> you know, win the fight. Whatever. Everyone act casual. I've been uh, getting some coal from my machine on the other side there because I need a bunch of it for this. Also, if we talk about how nice these stack sizes are, look at that. <sighs> So nice for inventory management. Anyway, let's um, let's fix this guy's body a little bit. A little bit. Ooh, hello. I think this looks kind of strange. Let's 
feel like maybe we should. No, maybe it's the back that needs to come in. I don't know, something seems off about that. Either way, let's um, try and get ahead on him. That might be like a semi-decent idea. Now normally, I think we'd probably just bring it up. <sighs> darn, darn tootin', darn tootin'. Uh, okay, let's see if I can get back up there. There we go. Um, so I think his head would be sort of be like right here. I didn't bring any blue blocks. Uh, I think we'd put his eyes. Hmm, what do I want to use for eyes? That's a good question. Hmm, that's a bit of a strange head. Let's, uh, I'm thinking maybe number pads could look kind of cool for eyes. Uh, I don't know, though. Hey, mm, pressure plates are kind of weird. I don't know. We'll try number pads. I was thinking they might look kind of interesting. We could do, like, arc scenery, but uh, maybe we should leave that to the pros. Okay, well, uh... And he needs, like, a beak, right? Penguins have beaks. Nope. Mm, that block. Let's see what this looks like. I'm a little nervous. You know what? Not terrible. He's kind of derpy. You know what? I'm... I, mm, do I like him? I kind of like him. He's a little derpy looking, but... It's definitely a penguin hanging out on our lake. And the ice around now makes a little bit more sense. I like the platform a lot. Hmm. Um, I'm going to leave him like this for now. You guys let me know if he's too derpy, if he's just the right amount. What I could do to adjust him. I kind of like him. You know, he's a bit different than uh, the guy Sidon put on the hill. I didn't want to just rebuild his, you know, even though he did a great job with it. I kind of wanted to try my own thing, and I think he looks... Good. I think he looks good. I kind of wish I could put the bow ties on him, but... They need a penguin mob. That's what they need. Stupid chizzards. Get a real bird in the ice biomes, am I right? Um, okay, cool. Let's go work on something else now. Look who it is. A purple monster. Okay. Oh, boy. Um, I was curious. I, I know I ask you guys a lot of questions, but um, some of you are probably real smart with things like uh, computers and video games. And I was just curious if you guys know what causes the most lag in this game. If I have a lot of machines in an area, if I have a lot of crops. I was just curious, um, what do you guys, or what, I mean, if you know what actually causes lag, let me know. There's a lot of arc signs in his zoo, a lot of machines, and that could be a cause of lag. We also have a lot of just other stuff in the area. So I guess I was just curious, um, if you guys know sort of what the lag is in this game. What really causes it. Are those rhyme cones? That's kind of neat. This was Sidon. He, um put all the blocks, he did an update video, um, and uh, he had all the blocks over here. He also built the chizzard coop, um, the floating chizzard coop, which looks so cool. Free one that you can get. It looks awesome. And I actually was coming over here to build one, uh, not over here specifically. Look how awesome this looks. Let's not spoil, because we're, we're going to build it, because I kind of want to show off the blueprint fill, because um, I think it's really cool. It's part of the new update, you can build blueprints easier. No yellow adobe walls in the library and repository. It's a shame. Either way, we have a farming area. <clears throat> Excuse me. We have a farming area over there, which I think could use a chicken coop. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, ooh, it looks like someone's building something cool. Ooh, look at the arc stones. I don't know what arrangement that is. That looks awesome. I don't want to spoil it. Somebody's building something really cool with the galactic blocks. I think there's a lot of really cool stuff you could do with those galactic blocks, though. It's a pretty nice set. We have to build a pathway over here at some point. Might have to hop on with Sidon at some point and uh, finish off our um, build over here. Either way, I kind of want to build this chizzard coop over here. I also was kind of curious how it looks 
uh, how the galactic blocks look sort of next to um, the industrial blocks. So what I was thinking is maybe right here. Kind of uh, tucked away to the side. Maybe a little bit over. Yeah, okay. Uh, so let's see. I have floor. Uh, well, okay, let's just get out the stairs. So, let's see, I can just... How do I... Oh, okay, now I can build it. So look at that, it'll auto-place a lot of those. So, I actually have to have the block, though, right? Like, I need the block on my inventory to be able to... Yeah, okay, so I need to have the block in my hot bar ready to go. I'm almost certain I got all of the proper blocks to build this. I don't think I ever separated them, which is bizarre that apparently I do not have some of them right now. <clears throat> Excuse me. Interesting. Okay, well, we will uh, build this. That's really cool. We also have, uh, we had a plan with the industrial blocks that came with the Robo Retreat, which is this massive blueprint right here. Which, maybe with this new block fill, um, we should build soon. Because the idea was to have this farm right next to this big robot lying down. And I thought it would be really cool. Um, yeah, we might have to get on a call with Sidon and figure this area out at some point. Either way, uh, very cool. I guess I don't have all the blocks, so maybe we'll finish this another time. Um, I'll meet you guys somewhere very cool very shortly. I am out of time for today, but I wanted to end today over here at Sidemaster's place because uh, if you guys didn't know, Sidemaster is another creativeverse YouTuber. He plays other games as well. Um, really good YouTuber, but he's uh, recently undergone a redo of his channel. So I kind of just wanted to um, mention that because he does some really great stuff. He's really good at the video editing and things and storylines and... It's a really great channel you guys should check out, um, but I also just want to show you guys this path he's working on. So he decided to settle down in a taiga biome, which is an interesting biome because there's just not many in this game. Uh, in the world gens, taigas are really small and few and far between, and he found this one. It has this matted needles. I think it's a beautiful biome, and he's been building with this style, the uh, weathered wood walls, and he's just got a really great base going on, and now he's got this road. Um, that's been going through and it looks so good and I'm just really excited to see where this place goes but I just wanted to showcase it he's uh looks like he's got some blueprints going on I don't want to spoil anything but this place looks awesome and uh you should check him out if you haven't and if you have uh I bet you're just as excited as I am to see what he comes up with so either way I wanted to end it by looking at a really cool road if you've been watching the channel for a while you know I have a I am such a sucker for roads in this game. I have no reason for it, but there's been numerous times I have followed random roads in this game just because they exist. Either way, that's going to do it for me today. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Uh, subscribe if you like Creativeverse or you're new or you're just into things. And uh, comment what you think down below. You're not here to prank me again, are you? Either way, I will catch you guys in the next one. A ciao!